We continue learning Rabbi Yonah's Pirish on Avais, in the middle of the third parak, Mishnah Yodalid. Continues Mishnah Yodalid, Hu <coughs> Hayoimer, which is Rabbi Akiva, Chaviv Adam, it's <coughs> it's beloved for a man. Shenivra B'Tselem, that he was created. B'Tselem Alekim, who's created in the image of God. Chiba Yisera, a special love, Naida'as Loi, was made known to man. Shenemar Kibbetzelem Alekim Asas Adam. Says Rabbi Yaina, B'mnei Shekefel Alashayin, because of the repetitive wording in the Mishnah, Yishon Aloi Meshkach Be'erushay. Says Rabbi Yaina, this is what the Mishnah means. Beloved is the man that is created in the image of God. Even if we did not know that we were created in the image of God, even still, would be beloved in front of Hashem. That we are created in His image. And now that Hashem told us that we are created in the image of God, it's a special extra Gesture of love. Chaviv in Yisrael continues the Mishnah. Beloved is Klal Yisrael. That were called children to Hashem. Chaviv in Yisrael no das lam. A special gesture of love is to them. Shani kro banim lam akoyim. Shani kro banim atam lam shem lo kechem gamze akif alarisha. This is the same doubling that we saw before. That would be enough. And now that we know it, it's even better. Chaviv in Yisrael continues the Mishnah. Shaito lam kli chachma was given us a desirable tool for wisdom. A special action gesture of love was known to them. That we got this special vessel of belovedness, of desire. Says Rabbi Yeyna, what does this refer to? The whole world is created with it. Everything was created only to fulfill the Torah. Everything under the heavens. Everything in this world is there to function in some form for the Torah. This is like a craftsman that has a tool for his omnis. And he does with it his malacha. So to the Torah is a kli for Hashem. And with it, the entire world is created. Continues the Mishnah. And this knowledge, Hadvarim, is incredible to Ellis, is incredible benefit to connect Hashem. Once it's revealed to us, the man is beloved to Hashem from all the creations. Why are we so beloved to Hashem? Because we are created in His image. The Yisrael and Klal Yisrael Yoidim. We know Kim Chaviv Mikol Sharumais that we are more beloved than all the nations. Kini Kram Bonim Lamakim. So it's a building in this Mishnah. Number one, every human being is Chaviv to Hashem because He created in Hashem's image. Number two is Klal Yisrael has an extra beloved and Chaviv to Hashem. Why? Because we are children to Hashem. And we are chosen. We are given the Torah that created the whole world. We know Hashem is close to us. Still, you should not think. I'll do what's good in the eyes of Hashem and not sin. is close to him. The sagas of man are small. That it's not easy. To reach this place of connection to Hashem. Should not be compared to him. That he's so far from Hashem. That's extra belovedness. It shouldn't be in his eyes. So Rabbi Yen explains to us that one's not a Russia, one's not a Tzadik. You have to realize that there's an extra Chavivos that Kala Yisrael has to HaKadosh Baruch Hu, which will allow us to come close to him, but at the same time, it's not to the easiest entity. And we conclude the Mishnah, This is how a man should conduct himself. You're not so far from Hashem. You're not too close to Hashem. Everything has to do with the deeds that you do, the mitzvahs, the ma'isim toivim that you do. For the great tevikos, there's no man 
that does good and doesn't sin. Says What does this blessing mean? Says Rabbi When I get close to Hashem, then what? He will be able to come close to Him. Who's going to be the one who should love to push us close to Hashem? So what do we see? We see that we have the ability. We are the bonim la we are the chavivos, but we have to do our part to push ourselves to come close to him.